Hello and welcome to another edition of Siena Saints Weekly. I'm your host, Andrew Champagne. In just a moment, we'll be joined by Victoria Nguyen from Siena Women's Golf. But first, let's take a look at the week that was in Siena Athletics. Men's lacrosse completed a perfect 6-0 season in MAC play with a 12-4 drubbing of Manhattan in the regular season finale. Next up for the Saints is the 2012 MAC tournament, which kicks off Friday at Marist. Siena plays the fourth-seeded Red Foxes at 7.30 p.m., and with a win, they'd play for their third MAC title in four years on Sunday. Women's lacrosse saw their season come to an end Friday in the MAC semifinals. The Saints played top-seeded Fairfield tough early on, but the Stags scored the game's final five goals in a 10-4 decision. Six Saints earned all MAC honors, and Amanda Corso was named Co-Defensive Player of the Year. Baseball is rolling, having now won four in a row. The Saints swept Macfo Niagara this past weekend and cruised to an 8-3 win at Bryant on Tuesday. Next up for the Green and Gold is a huge three-game series at Ryder, one that kicks off with a doubleheader on Saturday. Softball goes into the weekend with some work to do to reach this year's MAC tournament. Now at 6-6 in league play, Siena needs to win at least three of this weekend's four games. They host Marist Saturday on the program's senior day before ending the regular season at Fairfield on Sunday. And Siena Golf participated in the 2012 MAC Championships this past weekend. The women won the program's 12th consecutive conference title while the men finished 6th. Joining me now is freshman Victoria Nguyen, who won the individual title on the women's side. Victoria, welcome to the show. Thank you for having me. My pleasure. This was your first MAC tournament of your Siena career. What was going through your mind leading up the weekend? Um, I just wanted to play well and do my best. As a freshman, I didn't really have any expectations for myself, and I guess that worked out well for me. <laughs> Walk us through the tournament. Um, my first round, I shot 77. I didn't do too well on the back nine, but after that, I focused more on my tempo and my putting, and I came back and shot back-to-back -back rounds of 74. What does it mean to you to have helped the Siena Women's Golf Program win its 12th straight conference title? It's an honor. Um, it's truly an honor um, to have led the girls to the 12th MAC title and our first um, bid to the NCAAs. That NCAA Central Regional is coming up next week in Columbus, Ohio. What's going through your mind leading up to that? Um, I'm just going to treat it like any other tournament, go out there, um, have fun, and play well. Finally, before we get into the lightning round, we need to congratulate you. You were named Siena College's Female Rookie of the Year at the All Sports Celebration earlier this week. What does that mean to you? Um, it's an honor to have been chosen Rookie of the Year among such a great group of girls in, in the athletic department. and. Um, I'm glad to have been chosen. Lightning round time. Here we go. Your favorite movie? Uh, mean Girls. Favorite TV show? Mad Men. The funniest member of the team? Funniest member? My coach. Really? <laughs> Dave he's Ranowski, a, he's the funniest a funny guy. <laughs> What's the funniest thing that he's done? He just has these little comments that um, they, they stick to you because they're pretty funny. Every now and then he says them. They're <laughs> pretty funny. Your biggest pet peeve? The word lounge. It's really weird, but I just don't like that word. What bothers you about the word lounge? I don't, it's, I don't like that word. Did you have a bad experience with a game of Clue when you were growing up? I, no, I just don't like that word. Interesting. <laughs> Last question. If you could have dinner with any three people, dead or alive, who would they be? Tiger Woods. Harry Potter, and a Jonas Brother. Any particular Jonas Brother? No, any of them. I used to be a big fan. Are you worried about <laughs> offending any of the Jonas Brothers that aren't able to attend? No, I'm sure they're understanding. Fair <laughs> enough. Thanks very much for your time, Victoria. Thank you for Congratulations having me. and best of luck at Regions. Thank you. Again, Siena Women's Golf earned the program's first ever trip to the NCAA Regionals. They'll be in action starting on May 10th in Columbus, Ohio, and we'll close the show with thoughts from head coach Dave Ranowski. Uh, we're thrilled, Andrew. You know, first trip for the program, and uh, we drew a great course and uh, a very competitive field of uh, 23 other teams, but we're thrilled to be going. And how are you approaching these NCAA regionals, the first automatic bid by a MAC school? Um, as I told the girls tonight, we're going to prepare for this like any other event. Uh, we'll scout the course a little bit tomorrow and uh, start our preparation tomorrow. We have final starting, so it's going to be a lot of work, but uh, girls are up to it, and they're super excited about it. What are your goals going into the regionals? Um, want to be one of the eight teams advancing on. Um, it's a great field, as I said, but uh, the girls are playing great, getting better every week, so I'm thrilled at the opportunity for them. 